time we conclude, we'll herald in a new national executive for our great party, who in turn will lead us to a resounding victory in the forthcoming election, Allah willing. I want to use this opportunity to call on all of us to see this event not just as a platform for, elect for electing national officers, but for an opportunity to parentanize and interact with, your fel with our fellow party members from all across Nigeria, so that we can appreciate the rich diversity and the national outlook of our common brotherhood in the political arena. In the last eight weeks or so, since we undertook this assignment, the Convention Committee has been working very hard to make this day a reality and strike balance between various interests and aspirations, a task that is not easy in the context of a party in power and a government that is poised to sweep the first coming polls, having delivered its mandate to the satisfaction of Nigerians. It is therefore not surprising that the agitation for various party positions has been very vibrant and competitive, a situation that leads to foreseeable disagreement in some states. I want to assure you all that this is normal in politics and is a price we have to pay for being the party of the moment. The beautiful bride with many suitors and the most credible and popular political vehicle in Nigeria today. My team and I have worked hard to balance out the various interests at play and have strived to achieve consensus for as many party positions as possible. Where this could not be achieved, we have come up with the most convincing and visible, visibly transparent election process. I am convinced that for all positions for which voting will take place, a clear winner will emerge and whosoever loses will do so with dignity and the satisfaction that he lost in a free and fair contest. I want to thank our national leader, President Muhammad Buhari and the party organs for deeming us fit to handle this sensitive, critical party assignment and hope that by the end of this convention, we will have justified the confidence refers on us. I also want to thank the members of the main convention committee and the various subcommittees for the dedication, sacrifice, and team spirit they have exhibited in making this day possible. You have delivered on your assignment and made the party proud, and my Allah why do abundantly for time and effort you put in ensuring that all APC members are gathered here today with a positive outlook and the confidence that today's proceeding will leave everyone satisfied with the outcome. Finally, I want to call on all our delegates from across the country to conduct themselves in a manner that is consistent with our party's creed of discipline and fair play. The convention is not only a national event, but one that has attracted global attention, judging by the number of international observers and the press, people we have accredited to participate. We must therefore use this opportunity to showcase the spirit of internal democracy and set the tune for the kind of election out in Nigerian expect to see in 2019. I pray that everyone has a safe trip back to their various destination after the convention and wish the incoming executives all the best in their future assignment. Have a pleasant afternoon. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much.
Your Excellency, the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, permit me to stand on the already established protocol. 